Luke, do you like sports? Yes, I like running. I mean, fighting sports. Do you like boxing? No, I don't, and I don't really care about it. Okay, great. Let me tell you the story of the first boxing heavyweight champion. Oh, please. I really don't care. Intro. In the 19th century, boxing was already a loved sport but was very far from what we know about this sport today. Indeed, the year 1867 and the first version of the Marquess of Queensberry rules made boxing go from an overly manly man exclusive sport to a family friendly sport and entertainment. Before 1867, the use of gloves was prohibited with the London Prize Ring rules and fights under these rules were often contested with bare knuckles. Do you mean that boxing was a sport contested by half-naked men with bare knuckles, punching each other's face until one of them gets knocked out or bleed to death? Yep. Fortunately, the new rules gave birth to an early version of boxing we know today, which includes the different weight division, the runs, inter alia. Finally, I, I still don't care about boxing. Okay, great, but let me tell you something. One of the ways to describe this era is to focus on one sole character that left a deep mark in the history of boxing as he lived the transition between the two eras. John L. Sullivan was born in 1868 in Boston and started boxing early, explaining the tremendous amount of fight he won in his life, with or without gloves. However, his professional career only counts 41 fights with an incredible record of 38-1-1. I fight every day to get out of my bed. He's not that impressive. And I ate a fork once. I know what I'm talking about. His draw occurred when he was fighting under a pouring rain against Charlie Mitchell. As they were ripping flesh and breaking bones from one another, the police arrived and Sullivan had to flee. Indeed, boxing was illegal in France, Chantilly, where the fight occurred. His only loss was against James Jim Corbett, a younger and fitter fighter. He lost during the 21st round. He left a hallmark in boxing as he is often recognized as the first world heavyweight champion. Have you finished? Yep. You're not going to interrupt me once again to tell me things about boxing. Never did that. Yes, you did. And did you know that? That guy, you know? John L. Sullivan? The Gun Among Men? Yes, that one. He was beating his wife, an alcoholic doubled by a drug addict. Oh, he was not that great. No, he was not. 